Yeah, Rebecca, it's a meeting of Blue Bloods tomorrow here in the Delta Center, KU and Gonzaga. It's a unique matchup in that when you think of these two schools, you probably think one and two seeds. It's actually a four five seed matchup this time around. But regardless, this is a meeting of elite programs and elite big men. Hunter Dickinson talking in the locker room today asked about the challenge or opportunity, depending on how you look at it, of matching up with Bulldog Center Graham E.K. The Jayhawk big average is 18 points and 11 rebounds per game. E.K. goes for 16 and 7 himself per night. Dickinson calls him one of the best big men in the country. He actually got to watch him play earlier this season, not knowing at the time that he was unintentionally way too early scouting for the NCAA tournament. I was able to watch him a little bit in Hawaii, um, and I feel like that gave me you know, a pretty good gauge going into today, but been able to watch a little bit of film on him already um, since, since um, the game ended. Um, I feel like we're pretty similar in a way since we're both left-handed, and we both love to get, our left, love to, get to our left hand. Um, but he's just a really skilled big, really knows how to use his body and, and use the angles to be able to score. So um, it'll be a really fun test for me. I love going against other great big men, so it'll be fun. Both guys were really good in game one of the dance. EK had 16 and 10. Dickinson had 19 points and 20 rebounds. Another similarity is that both these guys are in year one with new schools. Of course, of course Hunter played a few years at Michigan before coming to Lawrence, Kansas. EK played at Wyoming for two seasons before joining the Gonzaga Bulldogs. I got more pregame or preview coverage, I should say. We'll get to pregame tomorrow. The Jayhawks and Gonzaga, a big one in the Delta Center with a trip to the Sweet 16 on the line. More coverage comes your way later in sports. Reporting live in Salt Lake City, Glenn Kinley, Fox 43 Sports.